And you and Glenn are away. That makes me the ranking political authority here, doesn't it? First bullshit of the new year. Excuse me, can we not start fresh? Let's have no expletives. Oh, come on, you love it, you saucy slag. Sorry, you don't love it. You saucy slag. Put it on the net. Doesn't matter about content, as long as it's on the net. I mean, just because it's modern. It, 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 the Churchill won the Second World War and, and never Googled once. You know, I got through more than 40 years with absolutely no knowledge of humus, and, and it was fine. Like, it's not that modern. It's also hummus, not yeah. humus. Churchill probably it's... ate hummus. Yeah. Hugh, uh, this is Glenn. Oh, Hugh, hi. No, no, I was just ringing your voicemail. Yeah, yes, well, uh, uh, I knew you'd be asleep, so th that's why I was going to leave a message. Well, then you shouldn't have left it on, should you? Yeah, I mean, well, the message is, you know, I've done the handover and I'm out the door. Well, look, I've said I'm sorry, OK? Yes, when I'm out the door, I will insert it up my rectum. Yes, it will be on vibrate. While we're here, we could bat a few ideas around. He wants something fluffy for the speech, does he? Environment? Uh... Slow, it's slow news time. I was thinking... I was thinking more laying into the PM, you know. We could call him, um, what is he? He's, uh, he's a lame duck. Yeah. Lap dog. He's a la la lap dog. The Andrew no, Ridgely to his own Home Secretary's George Michael. That implies his Home Secretary is a drug taking homosexual. That's not well, verifiable. Well, that's not bad, is it? John Deacon. John Deacon. Bass player from Queen. Didn't write that much. Another one bites the dust, but you know, we co wrote Friends Will Be Friends, but. Most of it's Mercury in May. Yeah. Puppet, lapdog, lame duck. Arsehole. All oh, oh good. Yeah. Um, it would be refreshing, wouldn't it? Just to say he's an arsehole. Yeah. The Prime Minister is an arsehole. He's looking for the last snog on the dance floor? Yeah. The last, the last bus home. Last bus home. Last bus, the, but there aren't any the buses bus. because he's... Because he's... An arsehole. What is it with the computer fuck-ups? Every department's got a computer fuck-up. What are they buying? That piece of shit from Blake 7. Malcolm. Malcolm, I've just heard from Pat Morrissey's office. It's actually going to be Pax oh, and Jeremy. Oh, tell us something we don't know, Terry. <sighs> OK, oh, happy new year, by the way. Oh, thanks. What is he going to talk about? Uh, well, I think he's expecting that it's going to be about his new book. But it's not going to be the new book. You know what it's going to be. It's going to be the fuck up. Not the computer fuck up. Why are you whispering? Well, I don't know. It's just smoke and mirrors, though, isn't it? It's finding a new angle. It's like Marks and Spencers. You know, you can still get white fronts and white bread there, but you could also get, you know, thongs and panini. <laughs> I think she wears a thong. Hope not. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised if she got a couple of paninis down there, though. <laughs> <coughs> Is your department looking at a 10 million overspend? Yes. Or no? Well, I don't have the figures to hand, but all I can say is that if there has been an overspend or a perceived overspend within this department, then certainly I think... I'll, but oh, for, he's not going to do that, is he? He's not oh, going to... Yes, he will, and he will do a lot more. Jazz hands will be touching you up under the table. He's got all the tricks. Well, well, for fuck off, Malcolm. You, listen, first things first, you need some interruption lines, yeah? Yeah. Something that you can throw in. All right, how about uh, I will answer the questions in the order you ask them, Jeremy? That makes you sound like a smug Oxbridge twat. Oh, I, I, I know you are, but everyone doesn't need to know. That guy's going to crumble. He hasn't got the chops. And he thinks he has got the chops, which makes it ten times worse. Paxman's going to interrupt him. Malcolm, the Malcolm, I've been thinking about it. I think we should pull this interview. I think we should send a statement instead. No, 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 no. That would look appalling. We absolutely need a body in there. Oh, yeah, no, he needs to do it. He should do it. I want him to do it. I'm going to ring round and get everybody to Sky Plus. I want to put the thing on fucking YouTube. OK, well... Great. All I'm saying is, do not cross the streams. What? It will be very bad. It's Ghostbusters, another good thing to come out of the 80s. You are such a girly man. Not everything in life can be neatly compartmentalised, OK? You can't put everything into boxes like in middle bloody earth. You know, sometimes the hobbits, those little friendly hobbits, have to be acquainted with the big baddie with his fucking scary eyes and Sound. they have to... Whatever his name is, they have to be friends, OK? It's called politics. I haven't got all your measurements from your wife. Actually, talking of your wife, Peter, how do you think she'd feel about sort of glamming up a little bit? Just so if I got news for you, don't do any more jokes about her. This is kind of general update, really. Maybe dye her hair. I mean, she's, I mean, she's a lovely woman, obviously. She's gorgeous, and you're obviously devoted to her again. But, you know, she's very grey. I mean, no offence, but she looks a bit like your mum. 
Right. So you 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 want me to go home and say, yeah. darling, the party thinks you look like Irene Handel. Sort it out. Jesus. Well, I wouldn't. You know, you could choose how you worded. That's probably not the best way, but it's just a suggestion. Oh. So you don't know. Well, not not having an answer is not the same as not knowing. So. What the fuck is he talking about? He looks like he might be about to shed himself. Is he going to shed himself? I'm going to phone in a fucking bomb scare. That's, That's a sweaty. very sweaty top lip. That is a sweaty, sweaty top lip. I mean, you, you could solve a drought with that. £500 million pounds over, um, well, over uh, the... Well, I this has got to be the worst fucking ever. Is this a snuff movie or what? This is like watching Bambi's mother being punched by John Leslie. That was a slightly separate overall... Um, well, if you'll uh, uh, just let me finish there. No, th this is it's going to be a root and branch overhaul. Paxo is, is not interrupting. Uh, no, the the, the um, uh, previous. Still, at least he'll be pleased. In, uh, yeah, he'll be thrilled, one. I'm sure. Uh, yeah. that, sorry, His not the department on the rack. You'll be like, hey, Holly, thanks for running the department, although it seems to have all turned to shit. But you're like the man with the Midas yeah. touch, except instead of everything you touch turned to gold, it turns to shit. You're like the man with the shit touch. Shit finger. Shouldn't you be online pretending to be a hobbit, eh? Trying to get a date with the lady hobbit. I'm failing. Shit finger. Oh, hey, hello, here he is. The walk of shame. You never told us you had epilepsy of the eyes. Was that a sweat or were you crying? Have I seen you on the telly? <laughs> yeah, Blockbuster, 1991, I got a gold run. You know what? I've never seen anyone sweat so much in my life. And I've had a sauna with Pavarotti. I mean, I know that, that, that politicians and hot air are supposed to go together, but I've never actually seen one vaporise. Can I get you two fellas a drink? I'll have an orange juice, yeah. yeah. Oh, I'll have a pint of fuck right off and die, you miserable fucking tosser. Do they do that in here? He's a wee bit disappointed. We'll get your news round next time. You reflected badly on me, and I don't like that. Oh, come on, Jamie, look, I'll get you a drink and then we'll... You want a what? fucking splinter glass facial? I'm not pretending to hate you here. I actually fucking hate you. I'm not playing a fucking game. Fuck off. He trained as a priest. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, it'd be fantastic. I confess yeah. everything to him. Ollie, Phil pitched Stuart the uh, cold face idea, and he's going with it. I, uh, I just thought I should warn you. Oh well, thanks a fucking bundle. Yeah, yeah. What else of mine have you been spreading around? Only your chlamydia. I'm an admirer of yours and was wondering if you would like to meet me for a walk on Clapham Common one night when there's not a full moon. That could just be a, somebody who likes walks. Hello? Hello? What is that noise? Are you scraping dead skin off your feet again? That is the noise, Ollie, of a man working in his sister's fucking cottage, working like a you can't say that anymore because it's racist and freezing half to death. It's great. I mean, you, you could be out and about, man of the people. That's you, isn't it? And you like people, don't you? Well, who doesn't like people? I mean, uh, some of my best friends are people. Uh, people who need people are the luckiest people. Surprising. OK. What the fuck is going on with this cold face bullshit? Did you OK this? Well, I'm looking at my papers here and, um... No, I don't think anything passed across my desk. You fucking lonely virgin, Julius. You know that's bullshit. Well, um... Where are you tonight? Cos you're not here. What, no invitation for number one party animal, Julius Pete Doherty Nicholson? Who's Peter O'Doherty? Stop trying to joke, OK? Don't joke. You are not funny, Julius. You're about as funny as a blind Todd on a fucking minefield. Ah, uh, Malcolm. Um... Terry's just rung about the uh, wankers announcement, and uh, I thought you wanted to know, Hugh's on the way to the airport, but do you want me to definitely tell him to get on the plane? No, it's too fucking late. What's he going to do, come and shadow the shadow of Dosak shadowing him? Show him where the bogs are. Yeah, but well, you told me to tell him to come home. Did I? Yeah. Right, Hugh, hi. Uh, no, I don't think you're going to be wanted back here. What is the problem? He's on some road somewhere where he can't do a U-turn for about five miles or something. Oh, good. I like to know that I can still make him miserable even though he's 12,000 miles away. How's the hovel? Oh, cold, damp and miserable. Don't tell me you're interested. No, I was just being polite. Yeah. Uh, Malcolm, it's, it's uh, Hugh. Hugh, just stay where you are. I don't want us to look as if they've rattled us. Ollie, look, I don't want to talk to you, Ollie. I want to talk to Malcolm. Well, I don't yeah. want to talk to you either, but, you know, Malcolm's talking to Hugh, so it's we've really not got anyone else to talk to, have we? 
Excuse me. Yeah, uh, yes? You are... Um, sorry, um, uh, you are... Uh, no, I was, I was just wondering okay. who, who, who the, you were. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, who are you? I think I asked first. Um, uh, who are you? Um, well, I'm here with Peter. Uh, I'm just curious as to, as to why you're sort of... Good, good. Uh, is everything um, yes. all right? Yes, no, I'm, I'm, um, I'm a senior civil servant in the department. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay. Yes, I think I might keep an eye on things. Uh, keep an eye? Um, right, so, uh, um, thank you. Thank you. I'm not <coughs> spying. You're spying? No, 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 I'm not spying. So you haven't come dashing back in a panic, then? Hmm? I mean, Hugh's in the papers, Malcolm's in the papers. No, 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 my dear Miss Heaney, I assure you, there is nothing like that going on. Everything's fine. Look, look at that. Rock solid. Very impressive. There you are. It's a good thing I didn't show you that one. <laughs> no, no, apart from the very funny business with the hand. No, everything at Dosac's fine, you know, we've got a solid man in there and... Everything's just smooth away. Really? Yeah, really. I was in South Wales, Hugh's in New South Wales. Yeah, everything's fine and calm. Calm. Yes, everything's fucking calm. Do you have a problem with calm? <laughs> you are going to be the non-sweaty new face of tough love. Where's your phone? Give us your phone. Um, I'm not news night. No, I... I mean, no, it's, it's a great policy, really, you know, it, 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 I, I'm, ju I'm just going to get screwed either way, aren't I? I can't deny that, yes. I mean, that is undoubtedly a possibility. You might well get screwed, and I can't do anything about it. You just have to decide whether or not that's something you want to do. So think about it and just tell me, do you feel lucky, punk? Well, well no. No, I, re I really know.